Vacuum metastability. Vacuum metastability represents one of the most existentially terrifying concepts in physics. According to quantum field theory, the vacuum of space itself might not be in its lowest possible energy state. Instead, our entire universe could exist in what physicists call a false vacuum, a temporarily stable state that could spontaneously collapse to a lower energy level. The Higgs field, which gives particles their mass, plays a crucial role in this scenario. Current measurements of the Higgs boson mass and other fundamental particles suggest that our vacuum might be metastable rather than truly stable. This means that under the right conditions, the vacuum could undergo a phase transition to a more stable state. If vacuum decay were to occur, it would begin at a single point in space where quantum fluctuations trigger the transition. A bubble of true vacuum would form and expand outward at the speed of light, fundamentally altering the laws of physics within its boundary. The wall of this expanding bubble would be completely invisible and undetectable until it arrived. Inside the bubble of true vacuum, the fundamental constants of nature would have different values. Atoms might not be able to form, electromagnetic forces could cease to function, and the very structure of matter would be rewritten. Any existing matter caught within the expanding bubble would be instantly annihilated or transformed beyond recognition. The terrifying aspect of vacuum decay is its complete unpredictability and inevitability. There would be no warning signs, no way to detect its approach, and no possible defense against it. The bubble would expand at light speed, meaning that even if we could somehow detect it, we would have no time to react before it reached us. Many Worlds Interpretation The Many Worlds Interpretation of Quantum Mechanics proposes that every quantum measurement causes the universe to split into multiple parallel realities, each containing a different outcome. This theory suggests that reality constantly branches into an infinite number of parallel universes, creating a vast multiverse where every possible version of events actually occurs. According to this interpretation, when a quantum particle exists in a superposition of multiple states, it does not collapse into a single state upon measurement. Instead, the universe splits so that each possible outcome occurs in a separate branch of reality. The observer only experiences one outcome, but all other possibilities continue to exist in parallel worlds. This branching process occurs continuously at the quantum level, with every subatomic interaction potentially creating new universes. The number of parallel worlds increases exponentially with each quantum event, leading to an incomprehensibly vast multiverse containing every conceivable variation of reality. The implications of this theory are deeply unsettling because it suggests that every possible version of your life is simultaneously occurring across different branches of the multiverse. In some universes, you make different choices, experience different outcomes, or may not exist at all. Every tragedy that could happen does happen somewhere in the multiverse. What makes this theory particularly disturbing is that it implies the existence of universes where the worst possible outcomes always occur. There are branches of reality where every disease is incurable, where every accident is fatal, and where suffering is maximized. These hellish realities exist alongside our own, equally real and equally valid according to the mathematics of quantum mechanics. Information's Paradox The information paradox emerges from the conflict between quantum mechanics and general relativity regarding what happens to information that falls into black holes. Quantum mechanics demands that information cannot be destroyed, while black hole physics suggests that information disappears permanently when black holes evaporate through Hawking radiation. When matter falls into a black hole, it carries with it quantum information about its previous state. According to the principles of quantum mechanics, this information must be preserved in some form, even if the matter itself is destroyed. However, the Hawking radiation emitted by black holes appears to be completely thermal and random, containing no trace of the original information. This creates a fundamental paradox because if information is truly destroyed, then quantum mechanics is wrong about one of its most basic principles. If information is preserved, then either the Hawking radiation is not truly random, or there exists some mechanism we do not understand that encodes information in ways that appear random but are actually deterministic. The paradox becomes more disturbing when considering that black holes eventually evaporate completely through Hawking radiation. Once a black hole has disappeared entirely, 
there appears to be no way to recover the information that fell into it, creating a permanent gap in the causal structure of the universe. Some proposed solutions to the paradox are equally unsettling. The holographic principle suggests that all information about the interior of a black hole is encoded on its two-dimensional surface, implying that our three-dimensional reality might be an illusion projected from a lower-dimensional boundary. Other theories propose that information is preserved, but becomes scrambled beyond any practical possibility of recovery. Closed time-like curves. Closed time-like curves are theoretical pathways through space-time that loop back on themselves, creating regions where cause and effect break down completely. These structures emerge from solutions to Einstein's field equations under extreme gravitational conditions, particularly near rotating black holes or in regions of severely warped space-time. The mathematics of general relativity allows for space-time geometries where the normal flow of time becomes distorted to the point where future and past become indistinguishable. In these regions, an object could theoretically follow a path through space-time that brings it back to its own past, creating a closed loop in the fabric of reality itself. Near the ergosphere of a rotating black hole, space-time is dragged along with the black hole's rotation so severely that all possible paths through space and time are pulled in the direction of rotation. Within certain regions, this frame-dragging effect becomes so extreme that time-like paths can curve back on themselves. The existence of closed time-like curves would create paradoxes that challenge our understanding of causality and free will. An observer following such a curve could theoretically influence events in their own past potentially preventing their own existence or creating logical contradictions that have no resolution within known physics. What makes these regions truly terrifying is that they represent zones where the fundamental structure of reality breaks down. The normal relationship between cause and effect, which underlies all physical laws and logical reasoning, becomes meaningless. Events could occur without causes, effects could precede their origins, and the very concept of a consistent timeline would cease to exist. Quantum Immortality Quantum immortality is a disturbing consequence of the many worlds interpretation that suggests consciousness can never experience its own death. According to this theory, whenever you face a potentially fatal situation, the universe splits into branches where you survive and branches where you die, but your consciousness only continues in the survival branches. The theory proposes that, from your subjective perspective, you will always find yourself in the branch of reality, where you narrowly escape death, no matter how improbable that survival becomes. Even in situations where death seems certain, quantum mechanics provides some infinitesimally small probability of survival, and your consciousness will always follow that path. This means that you would experience increasingly unlikely and miraculous escapes from death as you age. Car accidents would miss you by millimeters, diseases would spontaneously cure themselves, and aging processes would slow or reverse through quantum fluctuations. From your perspective, you would become effectively immortal, always finding yourself in the most improbable survival scenarios. The terrifying aspect of quantum immortality is that it suggests you might be trapped in an existence where you cannot die, even when death would be preferable. As your body ages and deteriorates, you would continue to survive in increasingly debilitated states, experiencing pain and suffering that would normally end with death. Furthermore, the theory implies that everyone else around you would eventually die from your perspective, as their consciousness branches into different survival paths. You would find yourself increasingly alone in a reality where you are the sole survivor of increasingly catastrophic events, unable to join your loved ones in death. False vacuum decay. False vacuum decay represents the possibility that our entire universe exists in a metastable state that could spontaneously collapse, rewriting the laws of physics and destroying everything we know. This theory emerges from quantum field theory and suggests that what we perceive as empty space might not be in its lowest possible energy state. The vacuum of space is filled with quantum fields that have specific energy values. If our current vacuum state is not the absolute minimum energy configuration, then it represents a false vacuum that could tunnel to a lower energy state through quantum fluctuations. This transition would release enormous amounts of energy and fundamentally alter the properties of space itself. The decay process would begin with the formation of a bubble of true vacuum at some random point in space. 
This bubble would expand at the speed of light, converting false vacuum to true vacuum as it grows. The bubble wall would be completely undetectable until it arrived, providing no warning of the impending transformation. Inside the expanding bubble, the fundamental constants of physics would have different values. The masses of particles, the strengths of forces, and the stability of atoms would all change. Most likely, matter as we know it could not exist in the true vacuum state, meaning that everything would be destroyed as the bubble passed through. The energy released during the phase transition could exceed the energy density of the Big Bang, potentially creating new black holes or even spawning baby universes with completely different physical laws. The process would be irreversible and unstoppable, representing the ultimate end of our reality and the birth of something entirely alien.